guys welcome back to the channel in this video we're going to talk about the best vv nfts to buy right now now i know many of you are thinking wow where has this video come from are you still buying vv nfts yes i am in fact guys i see what's happening right now in the overall market especially the nft market as an incredible opportunity to really build upon my existing portfolio and vv nfts in particular when it comes to premium digital license nfts i see as a huge opportunity because i personally believe once the floodgates open and people begin you know the the confidence gets back and people have money to spend i believe instead of looking at the nfts on open sea nft uh you know pr products like vv and licensed nfts will i believe will be the beneficiaries of the new wave of people that enter the space so that's why we want to get prepared now so firstly talk about some of the nfts that i'm buying at the moment so there's a few that i've bought now of course guys if you want access to everything that i have that i'm buying currently uh, some of our strategic plays across the overall nft space not just vv then join cc nfts which is extraordinarily cheap or join crypto group premium to get free access to that group only for today um and and of course guys you're going to get access to that but these are some of the uh the products that i have been buying so firstly beware the dark side on common um you know i bought this below 69 dollars and the list price was actually 80 dollars for this project and what you guys have to understand is and you should understand this from some of the dc direct um uh, nfts that we've seen so far on the platform uh, for example the todd which is a common it's not about going for the ultra rare or, or, or rare or common etc is also about the piece of art itself me personally i like to go for um you know the ones that i i think look the best first and the ones that i believe have the most uh, value uh you know uh, of course what i think people are going to deem as valuable and then those are the ones i select so beware the dark side you know, I snapped up a handful of these below 60. I didn't go above $69. I think the floor price has gone up quite a bit. Um, and this has fallen quite a bit from its all time high. So let me just uh, let's just see how much is. I don't think it will actually show me uh, how high uh, this was at all time highs. Maybe some of you guys can tell me in the comment section, but I'm pretty sure. Uh, this was way beyond uh, $300 anyway. Let me know in the comment section. But anyway, these this is one I snapped up. I think this is easily going to be a gem of the future, hopefully. And again, guys, I want to keep it completely, um, you know, uh, realistic with you guys, especially during the times that we're in. And I, I do believe we're easily going to go beyond a floor price of um, of, of $1,000 dollars uh, for this particular uh, project and of course the there's only let's just go down there's under ten thousand uh you know that are that have been minted uh and this is minus reserves so again very very limited i do believe oh here we go the board potential to raise there we go and has so far okay this is just overall sales but yeah so this is the first pick that I have uh, for you guys. I think we'll do really well above uh, 1K. And then let's go and look at our DC Direct license. Now, this is an important one uh, to keep an eye on. So many of the products that I'm actually buying are ones that I believe are 85% guaranteed. I'm not being hugely speculative. I'm not just buying anything that's fallen uh, in value. Or I'm not just going for any licenses. I'm going for the key licenses that have already done well. And I believe that when newcomers come, will also pile up on as well. And of course, Marvel is one to have a look at. Maybe if we have time, we'll look at that afterwards as well. So what do I like? I like the Jim Lee. Again, this was above uh, two thousand dollars at one point as you guys know i managed to get uh, this at uh, mint 
Lucky me, I know. I managed to get this in, at mint. I think the floor price currently is around $300, so it's fallen significantly from its all-time highs. I stocked up on some more of uh, this particular uh, licensed NFT because I think it's going to do well. I really like this one, Jim Lee Nightwing. For those of you that follow me on Instagram, and that's web uh, vision.web3, uh, you will see some of my stories where I've highlighted uh, some of these positions as well. So make sure you follow my Instagram. All the links are below, by the way, guys. Right? So Jim Lee Nightwing, as you guys you know, I'm super bullish on that. I'd also start to look at some of the anything from Harley Quinn series one, literally anything from this collection I'd look to buy. Uh, it, personally, um, I already have this in my portfolio, snapped up on a Harley Quinn ultra rare uh, during this time. Uh, Brian Bollard Penguin, again, this is currently around the just under $200 mark. I managed to get these at mint as well, but I thought, you know what? It was up over a thousand dollars at one point. It's gone down significantly. I'm I'm gonna scout and stock up on some uh, uh, Brian Bollard Penguin as well. Now, again, guys, if you want more of the of the products that I'm in, uh, again join cc premium or join cc nft links in the, in the description uh, but there's so much opportunity at the moment uh, the best uh, you know thing that i would say is go for projects that maybe you're already bullish on so you don't necessarily have to look for completely new projects so you could go for projects that you're already bullish on and just dollar cost average on it basically not dollar cost average but essentially you know just pile up on it so for for example the Jim Lee Nightwing you guys know I've been bullish on this since day one it was up over two thousand I think close to three thousand dollars now it's just above three hundred dollars so of course for a project that I already have conviction on it's an opportunity for me to pile up and stock up on this particular gem so look at your portfolio look at what you have don't overlook VV NFTs again 95 i was in fact i'm going to go as far as 98 percent of people are going to completely look past everything that i've said they're probably not going to take action at all but that three percent that two to three percent that are watching this honestly guys this is one of the greatest time to to really uh, create um that that you know that windfall of cash that you've been looking for because at the end of the day the actions that we put in now are going to be the rewards that we reap in the future so but remember, whenever they're fearful, be greedy, and whenever they're greedy, be fearful. There's extreme fear in the overall market. There's extreme fear, particularly in the NFT uh, space when it comes to the VV platform. Uh, and that's why, for me, I see this as an incredible opportunity to pile up. And as I said to you guys, if you do want to get more in-depth with my community, the, the NFTs that I'm buying, the VV NFTs that I'm buying, some of the cryptocurrencies that I'm buying, now is the time to really get in, join our community and take advantage of some of the outlook the analyst uh, analysis that we've, we've pro provided so far but anyway guys that's it for now until the next update see you the day